see we have this rectangular sheet having the dimension length and breadth and you can easily obtain area of this rectangular sheet by taking product of L and B. As you can observe these rectangular faces are stacking one over the other. So this is taking clearly a shape of a cuboid and it has the height H. You can easily obtain the volume of this cuboid which is given by area of the base into height. So in this case you can see area of the base will be area of this rectangle. If you take its product with the height, you get its volume. And in this case, volume is the space occupied by this cuboid. So I could easily consider this cuboid and I can obtain its volume. Where the volume of cuboid, well volume of the cuboid is given as area of base. Area of base into height. Area of base into height and in this case as we are talking about area of base, base is having the dimension L and B. This is L into B area of base into height H which gives me the volume of the cuboid as L into B into H. So I get in this case the volume of the cuboid as L into B into H. You can denote the volume of the cuboid by V. All these three formulas which are very helpful in solving the questions related to surface area and volume. Where lateral surface area of cuboid is twice h into L plus b. Its total surface area is equal to 2 into Lb plus bh plus hl. Moreover volume of the cuboid is given as Lbh. You have learnt one more important formula in this case. Diagonal of the cuboid here. In this case when we talk about the diagonal of cuboid that is clearly given equal to square root of L square plus B square plus H square. So mug up all these formulas to solve questions related to cuboid. Here these are very important in solving the questions of the cuboid. Note down all these formulas and learn them by heart. So I hope all these formulas are clear to you. Now let's proceed ahead to our next shape which we call as a cube.